All right, good morning, and we're back again. This time we're solving equations. These are one-step equations, and I'm going to show you real quick. We're just going to do maybe the first column, and then I'll let you do the second column. Again, you can always check your work and your answers. There's the answer key for you available as well. All right, first one, number one, we've got C divided by 3 equals negative 6. Again, this is a division problem, so I'm going to multiply both sides by 3 over 1 and 3 over 1. The threes cancel, giving me c is equal to negative 18. Again, that's a multiplication symbol. Those dots sit in there. Again, the opposite of division is multiplication. Some of you may recognize this. If I went to put a little 1 on the c, it would be like 1 third c. Okay, so the reciprocal of 1 over 3 is 3 over 1. So I'm going to multiply both sides by that reciprocal. Number two, this is a traditional one that a lot of you see sometimes. 3D, this means 3 times D. Again, the opposite of multiplication, division. Divide both sides by 3. Okay, my 3's will cancel, leaving me little ones behind. Now you get D on the right, equal sign, going kind of going backwards here, equals negative 12. Again, final answer. Again, get into a good habit of circling your final answer. It's always a great thing to do. Okay. Number three. Oh, here's an easy one. Z minus four. It's a minus sign. It's equal to four. This time, the opposite of subtraction is addition. Notice the same thing to both sides of my equation. The negative four and positive four give you a big fat zero there. So I'm circling it. So we have Z is equal to four plus four is eight and there's my final answer okay uh, number four 39 equals three times s again this is a multiplication symbol you want to divide both sides by three so you'll get s threes cancel giving little ones behind 39 divided by three is 13 okay and let's uh, do one more um, Let's see, additional, we'll, we'll do a couple more, like number six here. This is x divided by six, so the opposite of division is multiplication. So the six is on the bottom, so I want to multiply the top by six. I'm going to write as a fraction, six over one, and then over here on the left side, times by six over one. Six is cancel, and you have x on the right, and negative ten times six negative 60. Final answer. And number 7 gives, gives us the opposite type of question. We're at number 3. We had to add 4 to both sides. This is negative 12. 7 plus k. Notice the 7 is a positive 7. Now we need to get rid of that. So I want to subtract 7 from both sides. Okay, 7 minus 7. There's my 0. On the right, we have a positive k, which is what we want, and negative 12 minus 7, negative 19. So I'll let you finish up the rest of them. Hopefully that's enough to get you going on this one. Again, these are one-steppers. One-step equations. Either you're multiplying both sides, you could be dividing both sides, you could add, or you could subtract. Again, nice, easy one-step problems. Should be quick for you. This should be a quick worksheet.